Reeling from the aftermath of his older brother's death, 14-year-old Walker engages in an act of desperation. He prays. He prays for the pain to stop, and not even his own pain, but his mother's. Next thing Walker knows, Jesus is standing in Walker's bedroom. Jesus isn't exactly what Walker expected. Sure, the guy sports a robe and has some unusual powers of discernment. But he also wears size 11 red high tops and likes snacks from the vending machine. As Walker gets to know him, it's almost like he's not talking to the Son of God, but to a wise friend. What else can I say about this poignant little book? Does it answer Walker's and the reader's deep philosophical questions about why bad things happen or whether everything's going to be okay? Not really. But with humor and grace, the free verse poetry of Cold Town Jesus does offer up some ideas that are surprisingly universal. Above all, this, that the love you share with others will be reflected back to you. And in that love, pain slowly melts away, healing begins.